in Caldwell County did everything possible to save his father from their burning home, but it just wasn't enough. A neighbor's surveillance camera showed the desperate rescue attempt. Channel 9's Dave Faraday is live from that home now. Dave, investigators believe this may have started with a space heater. Yeah, that's what we're hearing, Allison, from fire investigators. If you look behind me, you can see the home here in Granite Falls. We're being told by firefighters that the fire most likely was accidental starting near a space heater. The sun tried to get in the home several times, actually at one point breaking out this window here to try to reach his father. Rick Earl showed us where his nephew tried to get into the home to reach his father after it had caught fire. A neighbor's surveillance camera captured these images. There were six people inside when the fire started. Five, including an elderly couple and child, made it out. But firefighters say David Dewey died after his son risked his life to save him. It hits hard because he's family, and it, and I can't imagine what he's going through and what he was going through at the time. I can, I can't even imagine what he was doing. Jerry McCall shows us the surveillance camera outside his home, right across the street. He was at a truck stop in Georgia and could see on his cell phone. Dewey's son bravely go into the home after his father, after breaking out a window despite the smoke and flames. I've never seen nothing like that in my life. Um, I can hear his father screaming, you know, and um, Junior asking, telling him that he needed to jump out of the top window now, and he's like, well, I can't. Dewey's son was airlifted to the hospital after receiving burns to Granite Falls Public Works employees who were nearby, helped get him away from the home. Local churches are now trying to help the family who lost so much. We're trying to work together to, to get them some clothes and things like that and hopefully find another place for them to live. And that son, David Dewey, is out of the hospital tonight. He's actually out here at the home trying to salvage what he can from the residents. He spoke with me just briefly just minutes ago telling me, Allison, he does not consider himself a hero. He was just trying to save his family. Back to you. Well, as any son probably would, Dave, thank you.